All right, here's another repaint update. I just about have everything finished, except I'm waiting for the decals right now. He was supposed to have them all made the end of this week. And he said he was waiting for some warning stripes to come in. And if they were ones that I liked and I could use, he would send those with it. But if not, he would have. If I didn't like it, he'd have to make some. But all this right here is done, and this stuff right here is what gets decals. I hand painted a bunch of details out. Like the warning stripes and the Lee Bear name. Pads on the boom rest. Warning stripes. The mud flaps. Door panels and handles. All that stuff's done. All this stuff is done. The only thing I'm waiting for. Or I got to clear coat all the weights right here, and then that stuff gets decals. I have to restrip this. I don't know if you can really see, but it's like all clogged up. And I got to primer these and get those done. I should have those done today, but. After you've clear coated everything, put aluminum foil on your cookie sheet and preheat your oven to 250 degrees and when it beeps then you just slide your cookie sheet in with all your parts, all the metal parts. Stick that in and then turn your oven off and let it cool down to room temperature. And then once that's done and dry, let it sit out for another day or so. And then you can reassemble it. But what you want to do is you want to lean the parts up around the rim so the air can get underneath of it and all around it. Just like that. Um, yeah, just do that, but don't do the baking part until you are completely done with the clear coat. Once you finish that, let that dry for a day, and then you can bake it. And then once you get done baking it and everything, it makes the paint shine a lot better and it seals the clear coat and everything and it looks like a factory painted model I got some parts drying right now clear coat But, like I say, once all that's done and you, you've baked everything, then you can reassemble it. And it should look pretty good. I'll probably make another video. I don't, I don't know if I'll make a video like I did of completely disassembling the model. Might make a time lapse of it if you guys want it or I'll just make a video after everything is done and show you what it looks like I think I'll just do that instead of a time lapse but hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching